Thank you everyone for coming to Steno 24-7. I appreciate it so much. Tonight I am dictating selection number 5, 369 words on the subject of damages at 50 words for, per minute for you tonight. <clears throat> Ready? <clears throat> Let's write. Ladies and gentlemen, the court instructs the jury that just compensation must be determined upon the evidence comma under the instructions of the court comma and not upon the statements of counsel outside of the evidence comma if any such statements have been made. Furthermore, comma, you are not bound to believe anything to be a fact simply because a witness stated it to be so, provided you believe from all the evidence that such witness is mistaken or has testified falsely as to such fact. The damages, comma, if any, comma, to be awarded to the plaintiff are solely by way of compensation for pecuniary loss <coughs> suffered by the parents of the deceased. You can allow no damages for pain and suffering of the deceased, comma, nor can you allow any damages for the grief or mental suffering of the parents caused by the death of their son. The test is, comma, in view of all the facts shown by the evidence, comma, what was the probable pecuniary interest of the parents in the continuation of the life of the deceased. Under the law, comma, a probable estimate may be arrived at by taking into account the occupation of the deceased and the income which he enjoyed, comma, his health, comma, age, comma, and the probable duration of life of the survivors, semicolon, also the talents of the deceased, 
comma, his habits of industry, comma, his success in life, and the amount of aid in money or services which he was accustomed to furnish to his parents. This estimate you will arrive at from the evidence the parents had a legal claim upon the deceased for their support, comma, and it is presumed that they suffered some pecuniary loss. The amount of each loss is for the jury to determine. If the plaintiff is entitled to recover in this case, comma, he is entitled to recover, comma, in addition to the pecuniary loss already referred to, comma, the reasonable value of doctor bills, comma, funeral expenses, comma, and all other disbursements paid out as a result of the death. And there you have it. 50 words per minute jury charge. I hope I see you at the next video. And if you like what I'm doing here. Can you give me a thumbs up? And if you haven't subscribed. Can you subscribe please? <clears throat> Thank you so much. And have a wonderful evening everyone. And happy writing.